Tom Cruise and Mission Impossible comes out. I'm going to see it. I haven't seen it yet. Uh, I want to support the movie, but I don't know when I'm going to go to see it. I just, I don't know. I haven't been feeling well, so I'm, you know, I just don't feel like sitting up in the movie theater for whatever time it is for the movie. You know, and movies be long nowadays, like a hour and 50 minutes or more, two hours and something. That's a long time for me. I mean, man. So I haven't seen it, but I plan to go see it. What other? Hijack on Apple TV. If you haven't seen that, with Idris Elba, I hope I said his name right. Remember, you're not watching entertainment tonight. Nobody's paying me. Uh, so I can't get fired because uh, the reporter didn't spell uh, pronounce Idris Eldris. E B Boo Boo. The guy, <laughs> the guy that everybody wanted to play James Bond. That's the guy. You know who I'm talking. Idris Elba. Iba Uba. Abu Ubu. Ubi 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 It's a great movie. Uh, a series, rather. Right? I mean, I don't know if it's great, but I watch it. You know, I've been watching it every time it come out on Wednesdays. If you haven't watched it, it's about like a plane that's getting uh, hijacked and... Uh, Idris, 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 Idris plays this guy who who solves problems. You know, he comes in, he's a mediator. And he's like, you know, using his mediation skills to, um, you know, deal with this hijacking. And it's really difficult for people to understand what he's doing. Uh, but anyway... The last episode was episode four, I think. Oh man, they got episode five. Look, see, cause look, I got all the check marks. Boom, boom. But I ain't got a check mark on that. Guess what I'm watching when I get out do get done while doing this? Hijack. Episode five. So in episode four. Boop, 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 bloopers. I mean, uh you know what I mean. Um spoilers. Well, it's not really a spoiler because I'm not going to tell you, but I'm going to tell you what I thought while I was watching what I was seeing. So it's a scene between him and this hijacker and uh, the hijacker is injured and he's talking to his mom right on the phone for the last time because he's going to die. Right. And it was just so I mean, it was just two people. Right. And he's at the phone. And it was just really uh, a good scene as far as, you know, it was like just so many emotions going through, you know, all the different things. It's here he's the bad guy, but Edris is using his humanity to, to disarm this guy, even though he clearly really means it, right? And the, the guy finally accepts that you know he really does care, and uh, it was really a tearjerker. I was like, oh. I do cry while I'm watching movies too. I don't know. I don't know when that started, but some movies I wouldn't want to watch with people because they made my eyes water. Like um, Mr. Church. You ever seen Mr. Church with? Uh, Uh, Eddie Murphy. Oh my goodness. And I think it was because my mother passed from uh, lung and breast cancer. And the character was had cancer and it was just, it was just so many different things in there that I was, that I recognized from Dylan, you know, having a, a parent that dealt with uh, cancer. And uh, it was just, tearjerker for real like, man, I would have needed a whole box of tissues if I saw that at the movies I would have been up in there like uh, 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 <laughs> but you know again I, 
I, I mean, it was a very touching movie. If you have someone who, you know, uh, you know, maybe passed from cancer or dealt with cancer, check out Mr. Church with Eddie Murphy. Boy, but but make sure you got some tissue, because if you're that type of person, right? Some people are, you know, nowadays they ain't got no feelings. I have feelings because I'm in touch with the Lord. I am part of the Lord, right? I am his light. Or as I get closer to him, if I can be less of me and more him, then I can be, right? People be like, I want to meet the Lord. I want to get to that place where I meet the Lord. I don't, I don't even feel like I deserve to meet God. What the fuck? Who am I to look at God's face? You know, I'm, this is me, if I even make it. <laughs> I don't even want to look. <laughs> How the fuck? Who am I to look at God's face, right? I don't want to look at God's face. This is me. This is all I want to do. Just chill with the Lord. I just want to be in his presence. You know what I'm saying? Just don't even talk about nothing. What is there to talk about? You know, I'm with God. 